So with all the channels set, we're almost done with the sort of general MIDI configuration, but there are a couple other things we have to do. So remember that this DIN MIDI thing here is supposed to be a loop, right? I want to make sure that it's a fully closed loop so that when I try to connect Timeline or Mobius to the original version of Nixie, they can be seen. But that means that the water has to flow all the way through the devices and back. Each one of these devices has to have the MIDI through parameter enabled. So MIDI through is the parameter by which a device will allow MIDI input coming to its input to pass directly to its output. If that's not turned on, none of these guys will be able to do anything from commands sent from here. So first thing to do is do that on Volante. So if we power up Volante again, get it into the power up mode, this guy the third dude here, third light, determines whether or not MIDI through is on. So if it's red, MIDI through is on, which is cool. So MIDI through is now on. It's ready. It's rebooted. Globals are the same place that we went to earlier for MIDI channel. So I need MIDI TH. MIDI through. Turn it on. Good. Same procedure here. Get into the globals. Go to MIDI TH through, turn it on, jump out, and now that'll be saved. And then Big Sky MX is similar. Get into globals, MIDI channel, MIDI CC, PC, MIDI through, and turn that to through. And now all of our pedals here will send the command that it received at its input to its output. So if this guy is telling Big Sky to do something, these three pedals don't block that message.